Hello there, Master Hellish here, and welcome back to my City Skylines Let's Play. You joined me when, not far after last episode, when I realised there was no parks in some areas of, well, most of the city. So I'm just going around now, putting some good ones in, but I'm just trying to find where I can fit them. I mean, this area down here seems terrible, so maybe next to this main road, it's a space already occupied, so I think there's like a, yeah, I mean that park's just probably just way too big. So let's let's put some small parks in. They'll, they'll fit there much better. There we are. Look at that. Like a wave spreading out. That's much better. I mean, they're, they're not better in this corner, but we've got plenty of room. Let's put one on the end of the street there. And we'll do the same down here if it will let us. Slope too steep. That's all right. We can use the tools over here. We can use the tools. There we go. Uh, now, let's see. How does this work? Uh, is, hang on, which one do we want? Slope terrain, soften terrain, level terrain. So is it like this? Yep, that's it. We make it, make the tool tip bigger. Oh yes, that's much better. Terrain, terrain. We're doing. To Why is that not doing anything? There we go. Just level it out a little bit. Now, now it'll let us put our park in. Where's our park? There it is. Fantastic. That's going to make all those ones happy. We've got plenty of parks around here. Yes. So it's just round here that we've got no parks. So I think maybe, can we fit some near the centre of the town? Maybe one up here. Slope too steep. Hmm... The, s the slope was a bit steep up there. We can fit one in down here. That's going to help, generally. And we'll have one over here as well. Then there's a railway station somewhere around here, so it might be nice to have it not far away from the railway station. And then, can we get one up here? Is the slope, slope too... No, the slope's not too steep there. And we'll put one there. There we go, right loads and loads of parks now that's got to be much better what's that some people are ill that's fine traffic is traffic where's traffic 80 traffic's doing all right we've got a few junctions that are busy and apart from that we're doing okay now Actually, I completely forgot. Pause the game. Since last episode, I had to do some emergency work to this city. Just as I was saving down the game, I noticed that there was a big pileup round here of cars. They were backing up right down this highway. So what I did is I have a look, had a look at what was happening. And you can see, look, there's a dodgy sort of roundabout in here now. That didn't used to be there. And that's because the junction that was here, there was people in, constantly, crossing the road. And what it turns out is, is this area over here is so attractive to people, that all the people over here are trying to walk to it. So they're all coming along the road here. Look at them all in the streets. Loads of people, and they're all coming along the paths, and they were clogging up the junctions. So what I've done is I've put I've told them that they're not allowed to use these crossings and I put a bridge in so that people from both sides of the road can come over and I put a tunnel in right under the highway that comes out over here you can see the amount of people just walking down this path it's ridiculous another little bridge in there and it comes out into the central area and that solved nearly all the traffic issues there was a little bit of problem with this junction that was here so I changed it into a roundabout it's a bit of a wibbly roundabout. I wonder if we can actually make it slightly better with the Move It mod. Well, if we just reduce... Can I reduce that that bend a little bit? And then maybe bring this node out just a touch. Pull that node out a little bit there. There you are, look! Oh, that's almost looking beautifully round already. There! Oh, that's much better. Um, these bits are a bit weird, but I, I deliberately did that so that it would fit nicely around everything, and if I wanted to do more paths, I could. And it works. It works quite nicely. 
Now, where was that junction I wanted to check? Ah, oh, yes, I wanted to check these junctions here just to make sure we got the lanes correct. So, let's get our, um, our mod and just check the lanes. Well, yeah. I mean, we could, we could do this just to make sure that there's good flow. It, the, the turning of the junction was already correct there. And look, here, here, this is where it's bad. This is where it's bad because we've got these guys wanting to come here and we want to say, no, don't go there. Perfect. And then that will allow these guys to flow out a little bit better. If we run the simulation, there we go. You can see that the vehicles are now all coming into that second lane, leaving it free for these people. And that ambulance. Uh, I'll just do the other side quickly. So the, the off seems to be okay as it is, but the blue green and red will stop them crossing over on that junction anyway but then it's this junction that we really need to make sure everything's fine on so there we go fantastic okay so that's going to help the traffic over there brilliant now i don't know how our transport services are doing they've been running for a short amount of time now so let's check on how they're getting on so transport Okay, so on the buses we've got zero riders per week because we're not using buses. We haven't got any of the... Which one's that one? The tram system yet, but I do want to put some overhead tram stuff in or some tram stuff in somewhere at some point. Metro lines, uh, we are getting a lot of people using the metro overall. Some lines more than others. There's this metro line 5. If we just go, all metro lines remove. Right, metro line 5 isn't getting used very much. Which one's that? Where's metro line? Oh, there it is, I think. No. They're train lines. Oh, here we go, metro line 5. It's the loop. It's the loop that goes around the industrial area. Okay, well, we'll leave it there for now. That may be something I take out. And Metro Line 6, it's the loop that goes around the other way. I'll tell you what we will do. We will get rid of one of those two lines. Metro Line 6. It seems a little bit overkill to have it going around in both directions. That They're going to get a little bit sad, but it's fine. So the metros are looking good. Now, how about the trains? Okay, so we've got... Can I zoom out to give us a better train overview? I can just about. Okay, there's most of the rail network. Uh, if you hover over them, I can see that they, f they highlight. It's not very easy to see. But train six. Which one's train six? Uh, oh, that's the new one. That's the one from... Uh, or is it? Oh, it, it is the new one. Okay, so it's the one from Helisham. And it's very busy. Line 4. That goes to the entertainment... Oh, hang on. No. Line 4 is the one that comes from the lower district up to the upper district. It's not very busy at all. In fact, it's terrible. There's only five passengers. You know what? I think it's because it's a long way round and they can take the metro. And I don't think they're really that bothered about changing. We're going to get rid of that line. They're not going to be very happy about that, but it's gone. Uh, the next one on the list is it's got 14 passengers. And that's the railway line that takes it into the industrial district. And we're going to get rid of that one as well. There we go. So I think that's all the lines out of that station gone. I'm not sure. Let's let's check. Um, train lines. Yep. I don't think we've got any train lines going in and out of that junction. In and out of that station at all. So what we'll do is we'll just get that station and turn it off. They're not going to be very happy about that round there because that's transport services. But they've got um, uh, they've got underground. They've got plenty of underground. 
Right then. Well, so we got oh the airport. That's right. I still want an airport. Uh, we have to wait until we reach the next level of population. We just need our population to go up a little bit more. Quite a little bit more. And I'm not really sh best sure about the best way of doing it. What else have we got on transport then? We've got ships. We, we haven't got anything in ships yet. Monorail. Ooh, got to have a monorail. Where should we have a monorail? Shall we have a monorail that connects? I don't know. Ooh, we've kind of got everything covered with railways and metros. But monorail sounds like such a fun thing to do. Must be placed on a roadside. Well, what about if we had a monorail that went to the space complex? Round here. And then went somewhere else. Maybe up to Hellish Wood? The Hellish Wood to Entertainment District monorail service. I like the sound of that. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that. So, does the monorail have to go above roads? No, it doesn't. Okay. Has to go next to a road. In that case, we'll put it there. And the monorail service. Tell you what we'll do. We'll have a stop. Ah, we're going to crash into that bridge. Not good. Let's go over here. I don't know where to go now. Hang on a minute. I need to think about this. I want one over here somewhere. So, I can do that. Uh, we can have it, like... You know what? There's fine. I like that. We'll figure it out. Um, I don't know what we're going to be able to do with that monorail, though, to get it to go under there. Can we make it go down a bit? No, only up. Yeah, why not? And then the monorail service can come down the edge of the uh, launch facility, which is actually nearly ready for launch. I'm hoping by the end of today's episode we can launch that rocket. I've been waiting for quite, quite a few episodes. And then if I, I guess if we just keep going straight, we'll have to sort those power lines out. But then I guess I can come into the end of here. Right, what's that? It's a monorail station. Monorail station with road. No, just monorail station, thank you. On the end of there. Brilliant. Now, how can I do this? If I make it come out straight for just a little bit. There we go. And hopefully we can get a nice gentle curve in this. Maybe bulldoze that a little bit bit of curve. Okay, so we're going to come out for... Where's the intersection? About there. Come halfway. I think I need to extend the other line first. So, there is the intersection. If I come back to about there. Cool. That is should be lovely. Oh yeah, that's a beautiful curve that we've got in there. Right, let's fix the power situation first before we do anything else. To, do we need to? Let's have a look at the power grid. Okay, so it's just the facility that hasn't got power there. Uh, where's our main power trunk road? No, oh, that is our main power trunk. Okay. Um... Okay, power, 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 power. Let's take it from here. Remove that and that. And we'll bring it past the, the spaceport to, from here. Now, can we make it go down? No. You know what? I think this... Yeah, we'll just take it from there. Cool. Uh, we've got a small demand for commercial, so I'm going to put more commercial in here. Around the inside of here. There we 
you go. Now, how's the commercial down here doing? See, look, it's not doing that great down here. I, th I don't know whether it's because it's dense commercial or what. But we'll, we'll have to see how that goes. But that's the power sorted to both of those places. They're both no, uh, no, now okay. Our rocket is very close to being able to be launched, so we will launch it this episode. And now I guess we need to do some tracks, don't we? So, what's that? Metro line, go from here down to there. Even if it's just one metro service going up and back again. There we go. They're all very happy about... You know what, I would be... Oh, what's that? They're complaining, what? Taxes are too high. But this is the posh area. The taxes are supposed to be high around the posh area of town. I mean, you've got the beautiful buildings around here. I don't know what you're complaining around. You've got a fantastic monorail service. Look at this. Oh, yeah. With, with the nice... Oh, it's wonderful. Oh, look. Commercial, more commercials going in around here. Brilliant. Slight demand for industrial, but I think we'll sort industrial next episode. I'm thinking we'll probably expand this area. I don't know. We'll have to have a look at what is around there. Maybe this area. Maybe we could do it this episode. Yeah, let's have a look at doing that. Now, the land's all broken because I nicked all the land when I built this area up. And that was a big build-up. Why, why have we got buildings on the outside there? Oh, it's fire and police. Okay. So, we need to sort, all the, sort out all the land around here. How are we going to do that? The big, smooth tool, I think. Soften terrain. Let's get it. Uh, there we go. Soft. Oh my goodness, that's so slow. Uh, level terrain? I mean, ideally we want to kind of take like an average. And just kind of lower the high bits. I mean, I, I don't... It doesn't need to be flat. I just don't want it to be steeped. Steeped? Steep. Like that. There we go. I mean, we can have a bit of an incline around the road at the back there. That's fine. Or I could rebuild the road. Nah, we won't, re we won't rebuild it. Just soften it out a bit. Smooth it down. There we go. That. That. It's not flat. But like I said, it doesn't need to be flat. It just needs to be not monstrously different in heights. I mean, that looks good to me. Now, these industrial zones are all very linear, as are our office districts. They're all very linear. With this one, we're going to go a little, little bit different. Now, there's plenty of trees around here, so we're going to go with forestry stuff. So we'll start off with the roads. We're going to go with these roads, small four-lane roads. We've got roundabouts to come off here and here, but we've got a long road that I think really we need another roundabout in the middle there and two on the back road. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to just put them on the back road because it is very close to that back section there. But let's go for... Three lane roads, and do I have to do it on a junction, on a node? But we're missing some nodes. Wow, there's no node in the middle there. Right, I think we can add a node, but I can't remember how to do it. Let's try it like this. Round about here. Yeah, oh, that'll do. Um, couple more roundabouts. That's the wrong tool. Will it fit? Yes. Can I have another one, please? Yes. What road is this? This is the six lane road. Six lane, six lane. Is that six lane? No. Is it here? 
There. Think that's it? Yes. That massive hump there seems ridiculous now. Tell you what, let's get the road land tour. I hadn't planned to do this this episode. Uh, there we go. So what we can do is kind of just round the roundabout, just make it a little bit more flatter. It will take the roundabout height and just kind of bring things up around it a little bit. I don't know why we've ended up with a high roundabout round there, but never mind. As long as it's not too steep. Nice and gentle. We've got plenty of soil. There we go. Right, back to the road. Oh, good, it remember what road I had. Excellent. Fix this bit. Excellent. Now we're going to do some inner roads. So we'll come from here. I want some bendy roads. Uh, we'll come out there. We'll bend to here. And then we'll come out here. And we'll, we'll connect that up there. But then also... I want to come out there. Um, I think this is working. I don't really know what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of making it up. Though I do really like this. And then we'll have a couple of, like... A couple of dead-endy parts. And something round here. Should we take it from there? Take it at that 90, bring it through here. And I'm kind of thinking something off here as well. Yeah, we will. I like that. There's a bit missing, so there's a big space here. So, let's fill that in. Little road here. Yes! There we go. So now we're going to zone that with zony goodness. Come along these roads here. And just go right along there. Is that the main road? No, that's fine. Oh, can I right click? Yes, I can. Okay, I'm just going to zone this out and then we'll move on to actually putting things in. Well, there we go. There's the area done and I've also just put the water system in. Next, we just need to put in uh, some basic clinical facilities. I'm thinking just um, on the main road here, we can... Um, if we put it quite close to here, it can serve both areas. So on the main road, we can have a hospital up here. And let, let's put one over here as well. It's kind of serving the main area, but also a little bit of other places. We'll do the same with the fire stations. We'll put one there. And we'll put one there. I don't, uh, police departments will do the same too. But we're not going to bother with education or parks or anything like that. We'll add transport in later. So the next thing we're going to do is on the, um, let's see, on the commercial industry specialization, I'm going to specialize that this is a forestry industry zone. There we go. Which means in theory, only forestry industries will be there. So let's now go industry and paint everything in. I think it might be quicker if I just do something like this. Oh, I don't know about that. Ah, uh, yeah, maybe. See, it is saving on some clicks. 
got to be careful about which we, which bits we do though and which bits we miss so we'll keep an eye on that just make sure that we've got all of those included all the way up to there I want to get that bit and this bit as well and looking good we'll do those two these ones here but not those ones there we go right um, oh, nearly got some of the main road then I didn't want that and we can have these ones and those ones all the way up to here that was a bit messy wasn't it and we'll take those ones here too just so we don't get any on the roundabouts themselves well that looks good to me uh, we need to rename it though but I'll do that in a, f a future episode so down in the comments section put down what you'd like to name this new industrial zone and hopefully this won't affect the traffic too terribly we've actually gone up to 83 now with the traffic thanks to some of those additions and changes that we did like the tweak round here has probably helped this down here is getting rather busy so let's just double check uh, the management for the lanes before we finish off that's all fine there mm, this looks a bit weird we've got two lanes here so I think it would be best if we actually had two lanes coming out there and all of these lanes merged in here like this so those four lanes all merged down into two and then and then I guess we've only got one lane to turn off haven't we here but that looks like it's flowing quite nicely hopefully we can continue to make tweaks and continue to improve the situation there uh, hospitals is at a thousand Oh, we've got way too many hospitals for everything. Even elder care is looking okay at the moment. Um, but I'm really looking forward... Ah, look, we've got our first... Oh, our first industry. Looks like a logging plant of some description. Fantastic. Well, we'll finish this episode off by adding uh, a few temporary um, power connections. Once this is all filled in with industry, I'm pretty sure they'll connect up. Um... But for now, we'll just do something like this to come across the middle. And can I get that there? Can't see very well. That should do it, shouldn't it? Is that just outside the range? Nope. They're turning blue. Brilliant. Fantastic. Everything's looking great. Now I had hoped that we rate uh, we we got to the next city size uh, between um, before the end of the episode, but that's that's not happened yet. I think we need to do a little bit more expansion, a bit more investment, and we've got loads of space down here that we haven't done anything with yet. But to finish off the episode, it is rocket launch time. So I'm going to click uh, on the launch rocket button and. Uh, try and get a good view of the rocket launch I don't know what it's going to look like we'll zoom out a little bit so that we can see some parts of the city but here we go we'll get, what's this past or launches right here we go launch rocket oh we've got an automatic camera view fantastic Bigger beeps. There it goes. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Oh, I like that. Away it goes. Up into the sky. Oh, oh, we've got a nice wave of smiley faces across the city. Look at that. Everybody's so happy to see that launch. I, I can't get any higher in the sky. It, it's gone. Wow, that had a bit... Oh, no, wait, there... Oh, no, no, just a bit of trail. Bit of trail. No idea where that mission was to, but now we've... Uh, we've got a list. Bluebird Heavy 1. 
We launched it in 2029. It's now 2030. Hopefully we can keep rocket preparation up for the next part. We've had a massive spike in visitors there. And, of course, that's going down now. Well, that was a cracking way to end the episode. Leave all your thoughts, ideas and questions down in the comments section as always. Come over to the Discord and to find that and everything else about me, head over to masterhellish.net. But from me and the city, for now, thank you very much for watching and goodbye. <laughs>